from 2 a.m. calls, yeah. Zero communication, yeah. We spent too long in heaven, yeah. We felt the elevation. Two times different and we're not the same. Does anything have to change? I got no trouble with my pride. Got trouble caught in Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Janie. If you are new, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and follow your girl on all social media. Before we start this video, please be sure to pour yourself up some wine, some tea, some coffee. Get yourself something in a glass, so let's get into it. The reason this is my first time having box wine is because I feel like it's slightly a scam because this right here is $9.99. You guys have seen some of the other wines that I've reviewed and it's a full bottle that's $9.99 or less and I'm here paying the same price for a box like I understand like it's great for the environment and blah 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 but I mean let me not say it like that blah 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 but I mean I'm not paying for the box I prefer to pay for the alcohol but whatever today's wine is called bata mini um this is a dry rosé as well something that i usually don't go for because i'm normally a red wine drinker but since it is becoming closer to warm weather i know i'm going to be taking picnics and sometimes red wine can get kind of like it can weigh you down like it's very heavy so since i know for sure i don't like white wines i'm like let me try and find myself a really good rosé so this is 11.5% which a little bit less than I would prefer but I mean 11.5 is it's still pretty good. I personally just prefer 12, 12 and a half and up but 11.5 it's right there like I doubt that I'm going to taste the difference of it. So yeah um, this wine I'm going to put a picture of it like closer to the screen as well so you guys can see it better. Um, this wine it was rated by the 50 wine enthusiast as the best buys it has over 50 gold medals oh, it has over 50 gold medals i didn't see that when i was picking it up but okay so I'm, I'm having high hopes for this one and it says that this 500 milliliter box is equal to three 5.6 ounce glasses i mean i don't really pour my wine for the ounces that they say a glass should be i just pour it until i feel comfortable to stop <laughs> so let's see Okay. okay, I can actually, from how much I feel, I feel like I can get like another glass and a half out of it. So clearly I didn't pour a 5.6, I probably poured like a 7, but I'm, I'm okay with how much actually came out and how much is left. Like if you guys can hear that shaking. It's quite a lot left back in here. So this box might this box might be onto something. So this actually smells really good. It's not really sweet. It smells really crisp. I'm getting strawberry. Some peach. It's def I don't feel like it's apple. It's something something a bit citrusy is what I'm getting from this wine. I'm trying to figure out what. Mmm, I can't tell. And as I said, when it comes to anything that's not red wine, like, my nose can't pick it up as well as, like, my nose can pick up a red wine. Because, I don't know. Because I, because I just don't drink it as often. So let's actually try this one before we get on to Vivino. Okay, so it actually was not that bad. Like, it's it's really dry, and I like it. It's very bold for a rosé. Like, it's very, very bold. I like it. Let's, let's get to the vino. So if you guys are new, I take a picture of my box, I post it up to the vino, and then I put the screenshots on the screen to let you guys basically just see what it is that I'm reading out. So on the vino, it has an 83% match for me, which I, I agree because I actually really like it. The average price is supposed to be $5, so I paid double for this box. And I had a feeling like when I picked it up, I was like, 
this is really expensive for a box wine. So I was scammed. So um, the hints that people talk about are strawberry, watermelon, cherry, grapefruit. Grapefruit, that was the citrus I was tasting. Like it says grapefruit, citrus, lemon, but like grapefruit was definitely what I was thinking. I was trying to get like, I was trying to get my tongue on that taste. It was definitely grapefruit. I taste the grapefruit. Uh, peach, melon, green apple, another rhubarb, which who is this one person commenting on all of these things saying rhubarb? Because now he's making me or she's making me want to go try this stupid vegetable. The reviews of it are really good. It is in the top 9% of wines in the world and the top 14% of wines from California. Okay, I think this might be like my new summery drink. Like I'm very, very surprised that I like a rosé. Rosés are a hit or miss for me. Like they really, really are. So I'm very proud. The food pairings are shellfish, spicy food, appetizers and snacks, fruity dessert. I can see that. But yes, guys, did you ever think you'd see a time where I like something more than a red wine? Like this, I can put this next to the Astica, like the colorful bottle, I'll put it on the screen. I can put this next to it, because that was a really, really good bottle of red. But I can put this right next to it. Like, it doesn't beat out, like, the Josh for me. But summertime, I'm gonna need to find the $5 boxes because <laughs> I'm not paying ten dollars for another box, but this is really really good like it is really good And of course I had this served chill. I don't think I would ever even try Anything that's not red wine at room temperature like it just that would be a waste but Your girl is impressed by something that's not red wine. So we have a rosé winner for the summer I'm here for it. So guys, thank you so much for staying tuned to this video. If you made it this far, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow your girl on all social media. And if you're new, I'm sorry to tell you we're about to chug, okay? If you didn't start this video with alcohol, firstly, why didn't you? Why, why would you come to watch me drink and not drink at the same time? Like, the, comment down below, let me know. So now that you realize that that was a bad idea, go pour yourself something. Drink some water for all I care. But we're about to chug. Eleven point five dry rosé. You have earned the keep in my heart. I'm, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. So I'll see you guys next week for another wine down Wednesday. Bye.